And now for a look at stories making headlines around the world. The Indian capital of New Delhi is covered in smog for about a week now. And in Spain, its Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy urges Catalans to put an end to what he calls a separatist havoc. And a powerful earthquake shakes northern Iraq early this morning. And for a look at these stories, we now turn to our Duaram at the News Center. Adam, let's start with New Delhi. How bad is the air quality looking? Well, Simon, toxic smog has blanketed the Indian capital, forcing United Airlines to suspend its Newark, New Delhi flights. The company did not say how long the suspension would last, but it has waived some extra charges for passengers forced to reschedule. Other airlines are traveling there, but it is unclear if they will follow in the footsteps of United Airlines. Schools have been closed, and the government has banned construction and industrial activity. Harmful particulate matter known as PM2.5 was said to be hovering at around 680 as of Sunday afternoon local time. World Health Organization guidelines suggest levels above 300 are hazardous. New Delhi is considering spraying water into the air to try wash away what officials are describing as a gas chamber. The public is being advised to remain indoors and to wear a mask if outside. The city is infamous for bad air quality, but the smog over the past week created what doctors have called a public health emergency.